Hi, it's Carmi Weininger from the Reactor Panel Saddle Company, here to talk to you about customizing your jumping saddle or your trail saddle. And we'll just go over a few of the different options that you can choose when customizing your saddle beyond the seat type, seat size, and tree width for your horse. So this jumping saddle is called the Fox Hunter. It has a medium deep seat. It has a fairly forward flap. A lot of people use it for eventing. Uh, for cross-country riding and jumping. And some people use it for hunter-jumper um, where they want the depth of this sort of a seat. The saddle is made of metal, which is a very soft, flexible, oiled leather that feels immediately broken in. It has French calf on the knee pad and on the seat. We have a choice of four leathers for the seat and the knee pad and two leathers for the flaps and the skirts. Underneath, all of our blocks attached with Velcro. This is a fairly modern jumping block. Another option is the conventional round knee block, but just about anything can be put onto the jumping saddle. And there's a Velcro spot in the rear for a calf block as well, which is really a favorite for cross-country riders. Moving on, this is a VSD Summit, and this saddle's been done in two-tone, a black for the flaps and the skirt, and a dark brown shrunk, a patterned, grippy leather for the knee pad, the thigh pad, and the seat. In addition, this saddle has our standard endurance kit, which means it's got a fall down staple and a heavy duty D ring in front, two more D rings in the back, and around the rear it has some shaft staples, which I'll show you in a moment. The saddle has our medium length billets, meaning they're designed to have the girth attached down low on the sweat flap, meaning there's no bulk under the rider's thigh, but the saddles can be made with any length billet at all, a short billet, a dressage billet, or what you see here in the medium billet. And moving on, we have a VSD traditional. This is done in our standard leather. Again, it has a French calf knee block, or knee pad rather, and it has French calf on the seat. It has our endurance kit, but it has the addition of a set of heavy-duty D-rings on the front, one on each side. So unlike the last saddle we saw, which had one heavy-duty D, this has two. It has two more on the side, and along the rear, it has three shaft staples for attaching cantle bags or a crooker. And for those of you who are paying attention, you'll notice this saddle has panels on it, and it also has a saddle pad on on the right side. Um, just to let you know what you're seeing. And again, this saddle has got the medium billets and it has Velcro swaths in front and back for attaching any sort of calf block or thigh block that you might want to add to your feeling of comfort and security. If you want to customize your jumping saddle or your trail saddle in any of these ways or in different ways, just give us a call.